today. So what we have here, this just came out of our restoration shop. It's a 1929 Mills Poinsettia with a mint vendor on it. I got this machine. It was a really nice pure core with the original mint vendor linkage. It has the original reel tapes, a ward card. What I did is I, I kind of like to switch things up instead of going with nickel. I wanted to do a nice antique copper finish. I sent this out to my platers. I had it done in copper. So when it came back, it was in bright copper. And then we here in the shop antiqued it. We buy an antiquing spray. We spray it. It turns it black. Then we take it to our buffer and start polishing the highlights. This machine has its original award card paper as well as its original fortune telling reel strips. One of the nice things about this machine being has all the bells and whistles in it. Come on up here and show them, Jeff. You see right here on a lemon, it says free play. So there is, I have not put a coin in this, and when that comes up, you actually get a free play, okay? Which is a really neat feature. That was a little bonus feature in these. Uh, also, as you see, I have added a nice, beautiful top sign on it here, which is solid brass, says play nickels. And I've added a nice set of claw feet, which are all just bolt on. I think it adds to the machine. It gives it a third dimension, adds a little bit of uh, cool to it. Uh, this machine, uh, all the wood is refinished. I've put an original mill sticker on it. It's got original back door and a nice lock and key with the old snake key. Everything has been gone through. As you see, this is the original 10 reel strips. In the early days, they were 10, as well as it has a nice original cash box. Even the spring is still in there, which is pretty good. The mech has all been washed, clean, lubed. This thing runs really super nice. I'm going to just leave this off for a second. Um, so uh, let me play it for you a little bit here. Runs as it should, has a physical jackpot, so everything plays correctly and pays correctly. Let's go for the mint vendor here. Is what we get? Oh, see, I got the free play, right? So now I don't have to put a nickel in it, and none of these will go through. See, you get a free play. I've actually hit that three times in a row before. Oh, we got the plums, and then here is our mint vendor, okay? These mints uh, I got in, and they are actually lucite, okay, and wrapped with the old uh, wrappers, the old Vans wrappers, which will come with the machine, okay? So now that we've got our pack of mints to show you, here it goes, goes back correctly. So everything is real nice and correct in this machine. It's got the original magnifying glass here so that the operators could look in the window and see to it you weren't putting slugs in it. Antique copper, 1929. What's that make it, Jeff? 90 years old or 100? Too much math for Jeff today. He's a little, un he's just a little off. Anyway, beautiful machine. As you see, clean as a whistle, runs great. This is a beautiful early uh, gooseneck slot machine, 1929 Mills Poinsettia in an antique copper finish. It's going to be a great machine for you. Anyway, get a hold of Mr. Walker and we'll get that thing shipped out. Thanks for watching our videos. Antique. Mantique. These guys sell Mantiques. This is their store. I mean, we're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from 9 to 5 or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.